uh, a very simple question uh, which should be asked by all true Christians. Uh, we know that the, the Bible contains the spiritual word of God and it is the charter uh, that Christians are to follow, of course. Uh, but we seem to be surrounded by religious organizations claiming to be Christian uh, that register into the legal state and, of course, appoint lawyers to operate their money changing in the temple. Um, is it possible that lawyers could actually advocate what is of God's? Well, they didn't get the name Devil's Advocate uh, just by chance. Uh, we, uh, we look at uh, even the format of the book that they follow, you can check this out. Their, their manual uh, in England is called the Book of Deviling. That should answer the question. So if you belong to at least what they would call a 501c3 registered faith that claims to be Christian, mingled in with all the other religious faiths in the U.S. that aren't Christian, uh, and you have a legal team that operates for the legal cause of your religion that is based on positive law, well, you're using devil's advocates, and they practice deviling. That should tell you in itself, uh, Christ is your advocate, so why would you need a devil's advocate? 